For a long time, this tourist site, which is located near Almaty, was considered the main calling card of Kazakhstan. Famous guests came here from all over the Soviet Union, as well as great athletes who sat here. Just think about it, 123 world records. These are amazing results, which were achieved at the Medeo High Mountain Skating Rink. Hello, I am Shimbalat Pazil, and this is the program Travel Around Kazakhstan. Medeo is the highest mountain winter sports complex in the world. The area of artificial ice cover is 10 and a half thousand square meters. This area can fit into itself one football field together with the stands for spectators. Last year, 10 free skating rinks were opened in Almaty, but everyone who tried to skate in Medeo come back here again because it offers the highest quality ice, the most high altitude ice rink. There is also an indescribable atmosphere. Even if you come to the skating rink on any given day, you will get emotional satisfaction for the whole week ahead because there is a different atmosphere in the mountains and here you can also skate. Today, Medeo is a world-class sports complex with all the conditions for comfortable skiing. However, few people know what kind of effort it took to build this huge structure. The construction of Medeo was declared as Mega Komsomol Construction Project. It involved more than 1,300 people. Kazakhstan climbers also helped to erect a skating rink. They installed a metal grid and barriers on the slope of Mont Monatka to protect the building from avalanches. Concrete for the construction of Medeo was poured without interruption, right on the site just below the rink. Initially, specialists assumed that there would be stitches in the ice. Before world-class skating rink, this was unacceptable. Therefore, the builders decided to level the surface, covering the whole area with a concrete slab. It was then the technology of self-stressed cement was mastered. It provided high water resistance. During the construction of the sports complex, the concrete was poured not in a continuous layer, but in parts, so that the plates breathe. This had to be done because concrete has the ability to expand in summer and shrink in winter. Thanks to this Soviet know-how, the Medeo design still withstands any sharp temperature changes. The stadium itself and the stands were built of concrete. The high seismicity of this region has made its own adjustments. A monolithic structure was erected with a stable facade. Initially, the architects of this project planned to make Medeo a covered ice rink. To do this, an ice cover was to be installed above the ice rink. However, in the end, they decided to abandon this venture. And there was a good reason for that. This project was conceived not only as a sports complex, but also as a platform for the rest of ordinary people, who sit eight hours a day in the stuffy city premises. 
Here, they could breathe pure mountain air and even sunbathe, skating topless. Therefore, they decided to make the stadium open to the general public. From here, you can enjoy a stunning view on the high mountain skating rink Medeo. And the place where I am now is not just a mountain, but a complex hydraulic structure. Simply put, it's the dam, which was created to protect the city of Almaty from mud flows. In 1966, in order to protect Almaty from mud flows, the Malo Almatinsky Gorge was blocked with two unique directional explosions. A complex hydraulic structure rose to a height of 150 meters. On the southern side of the dam, there is a huge reservoir, and the rivers flow through the tunnel. In 1973, it stopped a powerful catastrophic mud flow with a mass volume of 5.3 million cubic meters, which significantly exceeded the capacity of the reservoir. This staircase leads to the dam, which is known to all residents of Almaty. It consists of 842 steps. Regular competitions on ascents are held here. And I must say that this is not so easy to do. I pass only 100 steps, but I am already tired. No matter how difficult climb up is, this process, like skating, gives a lot of positive emotions and helps relieve psychological stress. The fact is that in a small frost, the concentration of negative ions in the air increases. And this additionally gives vigor and tones the nervous system up well. When you look at the high mountain skating rink from here, you immediately see the circular object that resembles a swimming pool. In fact, it is a septic tank, where the clarification of mountain water and sedimentation takes place. From the central filtering station water is taken to fill the ice. Before this process, the water in the refrigeration station goes through several stages of purification, and then it is heated to 90 degrees. It turns out that hot water freezes faster than cold water. The hardest part of this design is a field of 2.5 meters thick. This is a multi-layered cake made of steel, concrete and insulation. And the ice is just a small outer layer, no more than 3 centimeters thick. Experienced skaters say that Madeo has the fastest ice in the world. And the secret of its uniqueness lies in the clear mountain water, which is used to fill the field. First, we pour half a centimeter of water, then paint the ice with white paint to reflect the sun's rays, and the ice didn't melt. After that, we do the markup, advertising, and then fill the ice. Three to four centimeters thickness of ice is good enough for competitions. For mass skating, ice should be made thicker, five to eight centimeters. This is how the four-time Olympic champion, Yevgeny Grishin, assessed the quality of the ice. I had to perform at all the famous rinks of the world in Shkua Valley, Cortina d'Empezo, Davos, Oslo. I can't say anything bad about them, remarkable skating rinks. But the best ice is Madeo. The best ice in the world is here. Our athletes owe the highest achievements in the world to it.
ice at this alpine skating rink is cleaned with the help of specialized equipment twice a day. In the morning, before the athletes' training, and in the evening, on the eve of night skating. Thanks to this procedure, the properties of the Madeo ice becomes the most optimal for skating. Part of the ice rink is the engine station, where there are four large compressor installations. They maintain the cold temperature directly under the rink arena, which helps to maintain the perfect ice cover. The power station is only a maximum of 4,000 watts. When there are mass skatings, ice is knocked out and scratched. We take off the first layer of ice, we even it out. Using a plane of 2.8 meters, it's the width of the knife. We scrape the top layer of the roller to an ideal surface. Then we again fill it with boiling water, so that all the gaps and irregularities smooth out to shine. Ice Arena can accommodate up to 3,000 people at a time. The record attendance of the rink was recorded on January 3, 2016. Then, there were 13,500 people in two sessions. It was a record year for us over the entire period of the ice rink. Madeo was visited by 355,000 people. This year, I think we will beat this record because only in November, 100,000 people have already visited us. Therefore, this year we hope that 500,000 people will visit our ice rink, of course, if the weather will allow it. By the way, not only news will help you to learn about the weather on Madeo, but also webcams installed near the rink. With the help of the internet, a sports complex can be watched around the clock from anywhere in the world. To buy skates today is not a problem, and it is even easier to rent them. Here, on the high mountain skating rink Madeo, there is a large supply of high quality and comfortable skates. And the most important thing is that there are all sizes. Please give me 42. Trying on skates, be sure to stand up and decide whether it is comfortable for you to stand. If you feel even the slightest discomfort, immediately try other sizes. While riding the discomfort will increase several times. When skating, almost all muscle groups of the legs, abdominal area and the back are involved. This is a suitable sport for those who want to lose weight or just look as slim as I am. An hour of active skiing burns 300 to 400 calories. And while moving, all body tissues are enriched with oxygen, which contributes to the acceleration breakdown of fat and generally activates the metabolism. Add to this an increased load on the muscles, and you will understand that with regular trips to the rink, you can quickly become more fit. Look at these happy people. A skating rink is a great place to have fun, spend time with great benefits, and maybe even find love. To get a benefit from skating, you need to follow safety precautions. Avoid falling down and also dress properly. Not too warm, but not too light. If you never went to the ice rink or just got used to lead a sedentary lifestyle, try skating gradually. Madeo is 
an important training base for Kazakhstan athletes. Practically every day, hockey players and skaters train here. Many of them represent Kazakhstan at the Olympic Games. During the 2011 Asian Winter Games, ball hockey competitions were held here. And six years later, the complex accepted the participants of the 28th World Winter Universade. Namely, the speed skating competitions were held here. Therefore, it is not surprising that skaters from the countries of the entire CIS are coming to train in Madeo. From the point of view of training for the skater, high altitude training is very important. And the nearest skating rink to Russia since the time of the Soviet Union is Madeo. There are no other skating rinks such as this one. All other ice skating rinks are flat, and we came here to prepare for future competitions. We skate here in the morning, together with a team from Almaty. This is, as I understand, the Children's and Youth School of Olympic Reserve. We are having a morning training session with them. Sometimes, if time allows, we ride together even in the evening. We liked it very much. The food is nice, the hotels are excellent, and the conditions for training are perfect. We liked everything and children are delighted from the mountains, from nature, from everything. For many years, the ice rink has been a huge concert venue. For example, the Asia Dowsi International Music Festival was held here for a long time, which was attended not only by Kazakhstan performers, but also by world pop stars. The successor of this event is the Star of Asia, which is annually held here together with the city's Akimat. This year, we will hold Speedway. This is racing on ice. This is an international competition. They were held here for the first time in 1992. Three years ago, we brought them back to Kazakhstan. Last year, competitions were held in Astana. And this year, they will be held again in Madeo. This alpine sports complex is considered to be one of the main attractions of Almaty. Therefore, all residents of the city and its guests taking a tour of the city must include Madeo on their list. Madeo is in the top 10 of the most popular a must-see tourist sites in Almaty. And as you understood from our today's release, it deserves it 100%. Here, you can breathe in the fresh mountain air, enjoy the beautiful scenery of the Transili Alatau, and skate on the most famous rink in the world. Madeo is waiting for you. I am Shimbolat Pazil, and this was the program Travel Around Kazakhstan.